Electrochemical grinding. Electrochemical grinding is a non-traditional machining process. The process is quite similar to electrochemical machining. This process is a combination of the traditional grinding process and the electrochemical machining process. The electrochemical grinding process is also popularly known as electrolytic grinding or anodic machining. The material is removed by the action of the grinding wheel as well as by a chemical reaction. Electrochemical grinding requires the following parts. DC power supply. Electrolyte tank. Reservoir. Electrolyte. Circulating system. Nozzle. Grinding wheel. Working. The workpiece is made to act as an anode, while the grinding wheel is made to act as a cathode. Sodium nitrate, sodium chloride, and potassium nitrate are most commonly used as an electrolyte. The electrolyte is generally fed at the machining interface, between the workpiece and the grinding wheel through a nozzle. This electrolyte forms an electric connection between the tool which is the cathode, and the workpiece that is the anode. There is no direct contact between the wheel and the workpiece, only the insulating abrasive particles protruding from the grinding wheel come in contact with the workpiece. A gap of 0.025 mm is constantly maintained, which is filled by the electrolyte. The grinding wheel causes the electrolyte to flow past the workpiece. And the workpiece material is removed by the simultaneous action of the abrasive and the electrolyte solution. Application. It is used for grinding turbine blades. Sharpening hypodermic needles. Grinding of tungsten carbide tool bits. Grinding of cutting tools. Used in the production of a thin walled tube. Grinding cemented carbide, refractory materials, stainless steel, and high alloy steel without producing burr. Advantages. The process can grind very thin materials of about 1 mm, which otherwise will be damaged if machined using traditional grinding operations. The machined areas are burr free. There is no hardening and cracking of the workpiece. The grinding wheel requires less frequent dressing. No heat is generated and hence no thermal distortion of the workpiece. The process is faster as compared to the traditional grinding process for grinding tough materials. Disadvantages. Both the wheel and the workpiece should be a good conductors of electricity. The electrolyte may have a corrosive effect on the tool and the workpiece. The process is not economical for soft materials. Preventive maintenance cost is high. I hope you have understood the electrochemical grinding process. It takes lots of effort to make such informative videos. If you are new to ADTW Learn, support by clicking on the subscribe button and turn on the notification to get more informative videos like this. Since it motivates me to carry on this work, and see you in the next video.